Hello, good morning. I'm parked outside right now on my phone. I'm gonna see how this phone footage looks because I just came out to do my birthday activities and I didn't bring my normal camera, but I've been meaning to try this phone anyway and see like what the deal is, um, how it looks for YouTube. Um, but I'm at Dunkin' Donuts right now, about to redeem my free birthday drink, which is like the only thing I like at Dunkin' is like I really like their coffees. I don't even really like them. I had a phase when I was in New York and it started there and then sort of came here, but it's like, I don't get it very often. Um, it's not very close to my house. So I had to drive like 15 minutes as soon as I woke up today. And that was just also unique because I don't, I have not driven in the morning in so long because I usually, um, take the bus to work and then I stop going to work so it's not the best start for me I don't love doing it the reason I'm up early and it's so foggy there's like almost it's hard to even drive is that I have a meeting from 8 to 10 and it's already 7 30 almost so I have to hustle but I'm still, like, I technically took the day off work, but I am still have some meetings that feel really important. They're like foundational meetings or meetings where I'm presenting that I just didn't bother to tell people because our timelines are so tight. And it's like, I wasn't really good at going anywhere. I just really wanted a chill day. So once I finish this meeting, I'm gonna go on a run and I'm going to do a lot of like stuff for myself and chill but um then I have another one at three but um yeah so getting my large 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 coffee right now um I don't even want it right now I always get the iced but I'm just gonna get it so I can have it later because it's just early <laughs> I mean I normally wake up at this time but it's like I want to be in bed. Now I have to go. But yeah, it's my birthday and I can cry if I want to. And it's going to be a nice day. And then there's tomorrow and the day after and the day after and the day after and the day after. And uh, technically my birthday is, should be yesterday because I was born in China. So uh, we just won't. There's no need to get so particular on the day. Um, so I'm gonna go grab my coffee and I will see you later. Bye. Okay, I'm back. And I will not be driving and filming, but just wanted to show you how huge my Dunkin' drink is. This is my head. No, it's not this big. So it's like the same length of my head. I've never gotten a huge one like this. It's still the holiday cup. I got a large iced original latte with two pumps of sugar, which is like a vanilla sugar that I like because it's normal and there's no flavoring. And then two shots of coconut. Oh, and it's a coconut milk latte because the coconut shots were what I initially fell in love with when I was in New York. So I've tried a couple other ones, but I decided to do the coconut and hopefully it's good. And America runs on Duncan. This is very American. I feel connected to my childhood in Ohio. I don't know if we even had Duncan in Ohio. I was too young, but my parents didn't buy me stuff like this. They don't drink coffee, so I'm gonna try a little bit of it. Could use another pump of sugar, sugar, but I think I've been getting really used to really sweet coffee, so I need to um, I need to wean myself off of it. So this is great. Okay, 
I'll talk to you again later. Bye. Hi, friends. So that was an experiment to record on my phone. And uh, I just wanted to see what the process was like in case I wanted to do anything outside. Obviously, go get Dunkin' Donuts on my birthday, like, special thing. I had been wanting to try that for so long, like, go before work. Um, I actually had, like, a really long clip of, dunk, like, me talking in the car after that when I was on my way home. But it is taking so long to export onto my phone computer that that answers that question. I probably will never really do much on my phone unless it's a really shorter clip. Um, everyone probably knows this already, but I didn't realize. And um, I had fun talking on the phone. Um, I was stuck in traffic and I was late to my meeting. That was at 8 a.m. It's a couple days later because I just was I've been very, my time has been very counted for these past couple days, just scheduling some stuff. Um, but I'm still sort of in the middle of my birthday celebrations that I'm really enjoying. Um, yesterday I went to, well, on my birthday, I, I went on a run. I was extremely tired that day. I was, I think I was recovering from like a bunch of workouts and like hikes and stuff that I had all week and for some reason it hit me on my birthday and like so many people texted me happy birthday and it was like it was just a very multitasking like hard to focus kind of day honestly I'm glad it's over and now it's just like the weekend that I'm actually celebrating my birthday um and Devin took me to a restaurant that I really wanted to try for a long time, but not the typical restaurant that I normally go to. Um, so it was kind of like um, taking a chance on a restaurant, um, a little bit more expensive than like a usual dinner I would have. Um, and it was not bad, definitely decent, um, but I probably won't go back unless for a special occasion. And even then, not a super special occasion because it was not good. <laughs> But, um, I, he also got me a cake, which was really great from this place I've been curious about for a long time as well, that he thought I would like. I'm actually going to bring most of it to my mom today because she really loves cake and it's not sweet at all. It's a little bit, it's like even less sweet than I usually would make it. So I think she will like it and like, I know she would just, it would bring her so much joy more than me just eating it yeah I'm gonna have brunch with some of my old friends tomorrow and we have not gathered in a long time because of COVID so at least yeah um, maybe we did outdoors at oh at a baby shower we did um but not all of us and I was a little bit unsure if we would if we should do that but I think we're still going to do it. It's tomorrow. My allergies are killing me today. I'm sorry. I woke up in the middle of the night just like extreme allergies. Like lasting a very, very long time keeping me up. And it's very dry. The weather just suddenly got kind of weird. Like it was really hot yesterday. Like gorgeous. I went on a walk with my friend. Um, but... I, oh, and I went to work out at my gym yesterday. It was an amazing day yesterday. My energy was like at 11. But um, it was really dry yesterday. And then we knew the temperature was going to drop today to like 50 something. But it's like that annoying thing we have, which is like, like gusts of wind, super dry, high pollen count, dust everywhere. Like you open the door and there's like always this wind tunnel that happens outside my house. And there's like a huge pile of dust and leaves outside the door. It's, it's like, you know, that things are weird. So my allergies are fucked up. I just took one of my like holistic medications and it's like 10 AM in the morning. The power's out because I'm guessing the wind, um, damaged some power lines. So pg and E's out. I think I'm going to end it here. I'm going to keep enjoying my birthday weekend. 
and I just wanted to check in for myself because I love looking back on some of my birthday YouTubes to see where I was and I'm feeling like pretty good about this year in general, like this age. I think it seems good. I think it's just because like my day to day life I'm feeling better about um, with work and like everything else I feel good about. So um, yeah, I'm just in general like in a happy place right now. So um, I'm gonna go entertain myself um, while the power's out and I will talk to you again next time.